Um, I'm here for just a really quick tutorial. I was asked a shout out to Solar Animator for the little request here. Um, quick and easy, how to set up the gates in Hello Neighbor. So, just a little rundown. We got, you're gonna need one of these guys. So your general switch, you're gonna need a switch, and this thing, which actually I always thought was called gate but they have it under another name, the one that actually works, because the other ones don't seem to work. It's called a platform door. Oh yeah, it should work. Alright, so quick and easy, let's get rid of these so you guys are where, or I'm where you guys are at. Okay, boom, and boom. Alright, let's start. So first things first, you're going to need a general switch. This is going to be number two for me, so it will be... There, okay, next. <clears throat> hmm. Always uh, easier to work backwards, I find. Um, next is an actual switch. So just search switch. Uh, I kind of forgot to mention this, but make sure that general switch is a blueprint as well as this switch. Uh, you can use this one. I tried it with the picture frame too. It worked. Um, Few of the other ones, the light, the light bulb and light switches. That's the thing. This this technique here, well, technique. The way that uh, Hello Neighbor set it up, the doors, the boards, the nails, they all kind of work the same way. So the the bulbs. If somebody out there knows how to get the light bulbs to work in more or less the same way, please give me, like give me a little shout out, little uh little poke. Um. Next is your platform door. If my computer's not going to die, and it should be this guy. Here we go. Boom. So you take your platform door or your gate, as I would call it, and you find your switch minus switch number two. And under, I should be explaining this a little better. Uh, electricity, electric component. You'll find connect two. Uh, you'll have a little plus sign, hit it, <clears throat> and then find your switch, minus switch underscore two, then your switch, find your uh, general switch, which mine is number two, and then if you press play, and okay, so right when it starts, your switch is right here, the tumbler state, on, just turn it to off, and we have liftoff. <laughs> and um, if you want to change the actual end position, that's all over here in the defaults. The start position will be where it starts. Uh, you can also set the speed of how quick you want it to move. And then where you want it to end. Right now it's ending at uh, plus 400 over here. But we can change it to say uh, 400 over here. And then when you actually press your switch, she'll move in whatever way you put her. So that's it for the gate switch type of deal, platform door thing. Uh, is my game going to crash? Oh no. Anyways, if, uh, if you guys have any other ideas, uh, do, do let me know. Um, uh, maybe next one I was thinking of probably hitting, uh, one of these kind of fields and making one of those doors. If you guys are up for it. Alright. Ta-da! Alright, cool. Well, hope you enjoyed it. If you guys got any questions, don't hesitate to ask. And uh, that'll be it. I'm setting out.